Hello travelers, my name is Eric and I'm about to bring you to the top 10 places to visit in South Korea. Wait, not only the top 10 best places, but I'll also tell you the best, a must-try local food of South Korea at the end. So make sure you stick around till the end. Okay, let's go. Occupying the southern half of the Korean peninsula is the country of South Korea, completely distinct and independent from neighboring North Korea. South Korea is a thoroughly modern, engaging, and thrilling destination for travelers. Major cities like Seoul offers the buzz of an urban metropolis, along with fantastic nightlife and a chance to discover the latest technological marvel. However, South Korea is also home to scenic national parks and plenty of places where you can slow down and enjoy the atmosphere. From islands off the coast to the fearsome border zone in the middle of the Korean peninsula, there are countless things to do. See and explore on your next trip to South Korea. 10. Suwon The city of Suwon is the capital of Gyeonggi province, and it is just 30 kilometers 20 miles outside of Seoul. It is easily accessible from Seoul by car or train, but it often skipped over by travelers. If you visit, you'll be able to see the World Cup Stadium, affectionately called Big Bird, that hosted the quarterfinals of the 2000 and 2 FIFA World Cup. If you're not a soccer fan, head instead to the historic 18th century Huizong Fortress, where you can tour the architecture and even try your hand at archery on the premises. 9. Chuncheon Surrounded by scenic lakes and towering mountains in Chuncheon, the capital city of Gangwon Province, Chuncheon is the location of a popular Korean soap opera called Winter Sonata, and a lot of visitors in the city come to see some of the most common filming locations. Other travelers come for the food, because Chuncheon is known as a foodie's paradise. After touring major attractions like the Soyang Dam, Statue Park, or Chiangpyeongsa Temple, head to Dagalbi Street. This street features the dish dakalbi, a grilled chicken meal with spicy vegetables and rice. Dozens of restaurants on the street offer the same iconic dish, each offering slight variations on the recipe. 8. Busan The second largest city in the entire country is Busan. It's also a major port, and it is known for boasting beautiful beaches, as well as hot springs and opportunities for outdoor recreation. Busan's Gamchin Cultural Village, known as the Santorini of Korea, is a stunningly colorful hillside community overlooking the water. While in Busan, you'll also have the chance to visit several temples, the most popular of which is Biomiosa Temple. While the city boasts all the shopping and museums you might expect from an urban area of its size, some of the most popular attractions include Hyundai Beach, Tijania Park, and the beautiful Nakdon River Estuary Migratory Bird Sanctuary. 7. Jeonju At the peak of the Joseon Dynasty, Jeonju was its spiritual capital. Today, Jeonju is filled with temples and museums and is one of the best places to visit in South Korea. If you want to embrace the local culture and get to know its history, make your way to the Jeonju Hanok Village. There you can see traditional homes from the early 20th century, make the traditional hanji paper, or sip the locally made soju. 6. Suriksen National Park If you want to go hiking, see the best-known mountain range in South Korea, or just get some epic photos, then make sure you visit the Suriksen National Park. Within the park, you'll find pine forests, jagged and rocky mountain peaks, crystal-clear streams, and stunning lakes. Suriksen National Park is also home to over 2,000 animal species. Start your visit at the National Park Visitor Center where you can pick up free maps in English and Korean. Then, enjoy the miles and miles of signposted hiking trails that crisscross the entire park. 5. Andong At more than 2,000 years, Andong is sometimes referred to as the capital city of Korean spiritual culture. Perhaps the main attraction in the city is the Andong Hahofo village, where local cultural heritage has been preserved and is shared with visitors. However, it is foodies that will most enjoy a visit to Andong. 4. Jeju Island Off the southern coast of South Korea is Jeju Island, the country's only special autonomous province. Nicknamed Island of the Gods, Jeju is a subtropical destination known as one of the top honeymoon and vacation spots in South Korea. In addition to beautiful beaches, lava tubes, and lush green scenery, 
Jeju boasts a long list of tourist attractions and amusement parks. You can get to know the local culture at the Seonjup Folklore Village. Or you could visit Glass Castle, a theme park that revolves around glass sculptures. 3. DMZ The DMZ, or Demilitarized Zone, is the boundary area between North and South Korea. It is considered a ceasefire zone. While travelers can visit the DMZ, not all areas of the zone are safe. Only a small portion of the DMZ, known as the JSA or Joint Security Area, is open to the public. 2. Jianju Yanju is the ancient capital of what was once the Silla Kingdom. This makes the city more than 2,000 years old. Jianju is an incredible destination that boasts a number of temples and cultural festivals. Start your trip at the Bolguksa Temple, a true masterpiece of Buddhist religion and art that dates back to the 8th century. Then, hike up from the temple to the Sakurum Grotto for even more Buddhist culture and artifacts. 1. Seoul Seoul is by far the largest city in South Korea and a major destination in East Asia. If you're spending any time in the country, there's a good chance you'll be visiting Seoul at some point. There is no end to the attractions in the city, but many visitors start with some of the many palaces located in Seoul. Top picks include the incredible Jayongbok Gung and the 15th century Changgyeop Gung. You'll also find ancient temples and shrines, beautiful public parks, cutting edge design, shopping malls, and some of the best cuisine in all of Asia. Okay. Let's take a look at the a must-try local food, now here we go! Red Rice Cakes Tiapaki is a traditional Korean street food that's made with thick slices of garatyeok, boiled rice cake, fish cake, onions, diced garlic, salt, sugar, and assorted vegetables that are stir-fried in sweet red chili sauce, distinguished by its bright red-orange ensemble. This popular snack is usually sold at street vendors and independent snack bars. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks you for sticking around. Make sure you like my channel and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in next video. Bye-bye.